Hey, oh, oh. Oh, welcome to the vlog. We're engaged. Oh, wow. <laughs> and we got packages. You guys are probably saying, wait, Steve, I think you got engaged in Greece. What are you doing? in england with a bunch of boxes i still got the tan but yes Same. yada yada whoa whoa, whoa. <laughs> you're, I didn't you, mean. you're a taken woman now you did oh my gosh first thing she does when she gets engaged is show her little titties stop it get some help if you guys loved our engagement video think this man right here mr alec baker in the house he did such a good job on it and now we got culture stuff, so. Right. Of course, the guy with the muscles took the light bulb. I know. <laughs> That's how it always goes. So, we are here in Birmingham, England. Culture has delivered a bunch of stuff. I've gone without supplements for the last, I'd say, month. Gymshark, before we arrive, this is where we are doing our quarantine. So we can't leave here for up to 10 days, depending on how our tests go that we have to take. Not a bad place to quarantine. Gymshark came over. Dropped off some weights, dropped off an assault bike. Here are the tests we have to take for COVID. A lot of people have sent Morgan flowers congratulating her. Congratulations, babe. Thank you, everyone. And she's just gonna show everyone her boobies for that reason. You look like a dime. <laughs> we got in last night and I am on five hours of sleep. My whoop is telling me that I'm not really recovered, but I wanna get in that backyard, set up some, some training stations. Um, I'm switching from the fitness culture at home dumbbell program to the fitness culture garage program. So let's open up some culture subs and see what we got. Cookies and cream, love those two. We also got, ooh, Shark Boy BCAs. And we got Cherry Candy, love that for me. There will be a new protein uh, flavor announced later on in the month, so stay tuned to that. Um, Culture, we've been up since, basically since January. We had a soft launch, and I still feel like we're warming up, we're getting things right, we're getting things dialed in. Head over to the site if you guys wanna see where you can pick it up. Is this all the laundry stuff? Yeah. Oh damn, you guys got spit shakes? These are pre-made shakes? Yeah, that's it. What else we got here? Oh, way more. More more shakers, bro. Oh my God. You want a black shaker? You get a black shaker too. Let's go. Where's my free workout? Tropic Thunder, BCA, Pump, Peach Mango, <laughs> Pump, Watermelon Candy, Fruity Cereal Milk. Yeah. Alien Elixir, free workout, let's go! And Orange Dream Signal. Our latest folder here. Go, don't let it fall, man. Jenga, Jenga, nice, babe. You got a lot of stuff. So yes, I'm going to say it. I don't even care. Uh, I partnered with the people that did the manufacturing for Alani New, so we're kind of like partners and sisters. That's gross. We're engaged. Wait, what is this? Oh, that's my other one. This is the one I've been traveling around with. So after traveling around the world with two suitcases each. We now get to England, we'll be here for at least a month, and we have at least another suitcase full of Gymshark clothes. And so you know what? I think we're gonna need to do some giveaways. What kind of giveaways do you guys think we should do? Maybe I'll come up with it. Well, this should last a little bit. I'm about to drink one of these pre-workouts and get going. Welcome to the vlog. Workout in the pad here in England. We'll be doing a little partner workout. Morgan doesn't know it yet. It's gonna be a buster. We got I got 10 cows on that assault bike. So this is the warm-up basically. Well, we're gonna warm up do a 20-minute workout, partner workout, and then jump into program on the fitness culture app, the garage program, which will consist more of traditional movements, but if you just sit on a plane, you just feel nasty. It's like the best way to get over that to break a sweat, so feeling nasty. Let's break a sweat. Got my new Gymshark shirt on too right now. Feeling pretty snazzy. Looks like a good fit. Yeah, it is a good fit. The material, material is nice and soft, stretchy. I like the, the print too. 
freaking gonna lose my tan here in England though. Damn it, come on, son. All right, this is just really to get the body moving after a long flight. We've warmed up. Morgan's gonna be doing eight calories on this. Gymshark delivered it for us, very nice of them. And then she's gonna be doing 10 hand cleans, straight into 10 front squats. I'm gonna then add the weight and do 10 cows, 10 and 10 with a little bit heavier weight while she's resting. We go back and forth, 20 rounds between the two of us. And then we're gonna jump into more, some more isolated work, push press and those types of things. So the nice thing is, is you get a rest while your partner goes. So this is really gonna test our relationship. It's one thing to just date. It's a whole nother thing to be engaged and work out together. This is our first workout as fiancés. So we're gonna see how this goes. in England, done and dusted. My legs just have no definition. My kneecaps are really tan from grease. Just his kneecaps. My kneecaps are really tan. You can see how blonde my hairs are. You guys always say, Steve, do you shave your legs? No, but now that I'm really tan, you can see how white they are. You can see how, how many calories we burn in those 40, like 40 minutes. All right, guys, looking at that workout, 54 minutes start to finish. That's including the warm up. Max heart rate of 167, 167. Average heart rate of 125. It's including obviously the rest time and everything. Um, 450 calories burned, not too bad for a you go, I go partner workout. It definitely wasn't the best. The problem is I'm looking at my sleep right now. Anytime I'm in the yellow at 62, that's not great. Red is the worst obviously, um, but my sleep, five hours and 33 minutes. I was up way too late last night getting into England. I stayed up late and watched the PGA. My dude Jordan Spieth, big Jordan Spieth fan, big Phil Mickelson fan, they were paired up together. So I stayed up until 2.07 a.m. Woke up at about 8, 7.45. So not, not a whole lot of sleep, which has got me definitely uh, fighting my way back for recovery. So I'm gonna do some light jump rope right now for about 10 minutes. Just been trying to get my, my double unders better. I got 100 push-ups that I'm gonna be doing. I'm doing 100 push-ups in the morning, 100 push-ups at night or while I watch golf, um, and then a little bit of arms in between. So we'll go jump rope, jump rope a minute, push-ups, biceps, triceps, rest, jump rope, push-ups, tricep, bicep, rest. We'll do that for about five, six rounds, and uh, nothing major, probably get about a half hour of that. Sipping on some BCAs right now. I feel pretty sick, just body aches. So what we're gonna try to do in quarantine, recover, get a lot of sleep, eat right, Uber Eats, or what is it, Uber Eats here? Not gonna lie. We had some food that was not great. Everyone says, oh, America's got the worst food. It's so hard to eat healthy in America. I'm gonna disagree with that comment. It is hard to eat healthy in America if you're going to the wrong spots. If you have a Chick-fil-A near you, if you have a Whole Foods near you, 
you can eat healthy. Even at Chipotle, you can do healthy. So everyone that's always talking, especially a lot of English people, that are like, oh my gosh, American food's so fat, fatty. If you're going to Denny's and ordering the Grand Slam breakfast buffet, or if you're going to Chukarama, you can definitely get hellacious, awful, fatty, bad, bad food, the worst food, but you can also get some of the cleanest food. So here in Birmingham, we've struggled on Uber Eats to find some healthy options. So if you guys are watching this and wanna let me know, let us know what we need to order. It might be just a UK local healthy spot. So I'm thinking we might have to get a meal prep company or just order some groceries and meal prep ourselves. It's been a long time since we've done that, but we go do some uh, some more work. We call this uh, bodybuilder meets crossfitter, just circuit training, but biceps, triceps, push-ups, jump rope. Oh, if you want, use my code stevecook. Uh, on the WHOOP link in the descriptions. We also got all of our culture supplements and the culture program that we're doing all the while we are here. We have our summer sizzle going on, um, the eight week challenge. Probably by the time you guys see this, it might be too late, but we do it every year. So let's go do some more bodybuilder shit. <laughs> Outside, bring your weights inside because there's a 90% chance of rain at all times. Let's try not to break anything. We go shower, try to order something better on Uber Eats than we had for lunch, watch some golf, go to bed by 9.30, which means asleep by 10. That's the goals. You guys want to see what I do eat in a day in quarantine? Leave in the comments below or maybe a full day, uh, day in the life in quarantine here in England. Uh, we're supposed to have 10 days. I guess if you test on the 5th, the 2nd and the 5th and they come back negative, you only have to do five days. So crossing our fingers for that. But a lot of exciting things in the UK. We'll probably be here for the next three weeks. Just had a crazy trip the last seven weeks between the Maldives, well, Dubai first, Maldives, Greece, all the different islands. So looking forward to catching up with people in England. A lot of, a lot of old friends here, maybe staffs, the rest of the Gymshark crew as well. It'll be a good time. Just got to stay on top of that fitness. So appreciate you guys watching. See you next time.